Here we have Sailor Moon Season 1 Part 2 on Blu-ray. Um, I got this about a week and a half ago, and I'm just reviewing it real quick right now. Um, this is the back. The remaining uh, 23 episodes of Season 1 are on this uh, Blu-ray set. I'm not going to open up the set since I took all 6 Blu-rays and I put them in Part 1 of season one and all the DVDs are currently in this um, Blu-ray case. That's just how I wanted to do it for this set. Um, I'm not going to touch much upon this other than the fact that if you're wondering about uh, the quality of the episodes, they've greatly improved since part one. Um, there's almost very, very little ghosting in this um, set, in set two. Uh, I haven't noticed any type of um, saturation issues with the episodes. Uh, the one thing I will say is that there is some minor contrast uh, and maybe some sharpness issues. Um, nothing extreme. You see them mostly in the opening title sequences for each episode. Um, and they vary very, very slightly throughout the episodes. Um, they last just a couple seconds. And it isn't any kind of blurriness or you can't see um, what's being um, shown, or it, or which we call it, it doesn't affect like the video quality. I mean, you can you can slightly notice it, but it doesn't take away from the um, viewing the episode. So I don't see that as much as an issue. Um, the ghosting though has been fixed significantly. I mean, if you're really gonna fine comb the episodes, yes, you're gonna find some ghosting, um, but they're so so far in between in this set, so I'm happy that the Viz Media was paying attention to um, their customers. Um, bonus features are quite a lot. Um, panels are there, um, trailers are there, um, and some, some of the stuff that you'll see actually. Um, what isn't there that I hope would be there are the textless um, intros for the very first episode and the second opening theme for this is not included as a techless bonus um, feature, I guess you could say. Uh, but the first opening techless and the first ending are included. And I believe the second ending techless theme is included as a bonus. Um, other than that, uh, I'm sure you'll figure out what, um, what bonus features there are. Um, but just to run quick, it's the X Sailor Moon panel, official cosplay team interviews, Sailor Moon Day highlights, art gallery, and Moonlight Memories, Memories Part 1, which contains some spoilers if you haven't seen the finale of Season 1. Other than that, um, a big improvement over Part 1, and hoping they continue this for Sailor Moon R and the future seasons of Sailor Moon. That's all. Thank you.